Hello, my name is Henry Renfrey. This is a GDevelop tutorial. Today is a special day. GDevelop now has a 3D scene editor. The version of GDevelop that I'm using is 5.6. And the 3D editor is about as easy to use. 2D and 3D are very similar. Let me show you. So in GDevelop, if you want to work with the 3D scene editor, you click on this 3D tab and just like in 2D, you can click this add button. Let's say we're going to create a 3D box and then you can make adjustments to the 3D box on what you want, how you want it and everything and click apply, you know, just like in 2D and adding an object is as simple as just dragging it into the scene. Hold down the middle mouse wheel and you can see your 3D scene. And then just like other game engines, you know, you can move it around. You could rotate it. You could also resize it. I'm going to click Control Z to put it back the way it was. And then you also got this properties panel where here you could also resize your, your object as well. Again, I'm going to hit Control Z to put things back the way they were. So now if you wanted this box to do something, you could go to your events tab, click on add event, I click on add conditions. And just like 2D, exactly like 2D, I'm going to add a condition. So let's say if the box is in the X position, and that X position is less than, let's say a thousand. So with the condition, we want the result to be, let's say, click on the box again, and let's go down to, let's, let's say position X. Let's say if the box's X position is less than a thousand, then we're gonna add, we're gonna make it move forward by two pixels per second. Again, just like you would do in 2D. So click OK. And then let's click preview. So my box is moving in 2D. If you want to see your scene in 3D, just uh, click on action. Let's say click on box. And then let's go down to the camera section down here. Let's have the camera look at an object. And in this case, the object will be the box we made. Click OK. After that, just click preview. And now we can see our box move in 3D. And it stopped at the 1000 pixel line. This is just to show that GDevelop has a new 3D editor, a feature that a lot of people has been requesting. The new scene editor isn't perfect, and I still gotta uh, figure out ways to work with the camera stuff. But, uh, well, you all can experiment on that. Once things improve and I figure out more, maybe I'll make a future tutorial about how to do more things in 3D. This 3D scene editor really is a game changer. GDevelop is be one of the best game engines. I can imagine a lot of cool things is gonna come out of this. So go ahead and enjoy. Till next time. Thanks. Bye. <laughs>